Hi everyone, welcome back to Divinity Original Sin. And uh, I got the letter here, which uh, incriminates Lawrence, I think. Uh, yeah, this is Mining Office's letter. Alright. Yeah, he knew all about it. So let's, uh, let's first go talk to the wife here that was uh, pissy about it. We finally got the evidence we deserved. Where's, uh, where is she? Oh, there she is. Do a salutoin, hunter. What can I do for you? So you need help proving Lawrence knowingly encouraged miners to handle tenebrium. So? You are bringing results? Final letter uh, from the mining guild proving Lawrence's guilt. You have letter from mining guild? Let me looking. They tell... They tell Lawrence to keep mining tenebrium. They say they make him rich if he comply. The filthy pig. Oh. Mi voyagos, I see a patrino domo sur la dorso del camelo cae riproci si forte. I knew he was guilty. I knew he was to blame for Ben's death. Oh, I'll strangle him with my own two hands. Take my leave. All right. Oh, she, she's gonna, she's gonna go fight him. Holy shit. Why is Joanne oh, fucking uh, over uncovered? I gave him uh, crafting stuff. Fine. It's more important that we go watch her fucking fight him. I'm taking bets who wins. <laughs> I bet's on Joanne. One of them's gonna be a demon. Oh, Mr. Lawrence, it's true then. May Zal Moxes dry her socks on your mother's gravestone. Oh, what are you going on about, you crazy old witch? I know for truth. You bring workers to mines to extract tenebrium, and that you do it knowing they will die of rot. You greedy man. Malsata rapo. You kill them to fill your own pocket. Look, you... you're confused. You're ranting. Clearly, there's no reasoning with you, so what say you take this rather expensive token and agree to keep your little delusions to yourself? One thousand gold for my husband's death? Tell me, source hunter, does this man bring me for an idiot? I would be appreciating your advice before I strangle him right here and now. Ooh. <laughs> thousand gold is nothing. <laughs> Uh, now you should shout Lawrence's guilt from the top of the rooftops. Nadia should shout Lawrence's guilt from the rooftops. He doesn't deserve better after what he's done. That's right. I'm sure all those miners will have more than a little to say to the man who effectively killed their comrades. Ah, yes. That is spirit. Too bad for you, Mr. Lawrence, high priest of illiterati. Remember my darling Ben, when mob rips you to pieces! Wait, this is between you and me. There's no need to involve the rest of those cretins. They'll believe anything. Wait, Mrs. Uh, Mrs. Nadia! Wait! We can take the gold now, can't we? The advice. So now you she's telling everyone. I already knew this Lawrence was greasy snake. But now I have proof of his crime. I know none forget so many who die of rot when Tenebrium was found. But do you know that Lawrence knew of rot and sent you and your brothers to mine anyway? He sent my husband to his death. <laughs> and he sent you to yours. Make the monster pay. How is justice taste? Why is he talking to you? Plus, oh, Hunter, your compassion is sorry, not. You wouldn't let these pick, pick swinging yes. apes swarm, would you? I'm a man of mistakes and even more regrets. Surely no one deserves to be ripped to shreds by the masses. What do you think, Kent? Mm. I don't know. I don't know, man. What do you do? You got. No, no you choose, dude. I can't decide. Actually, you know what? Fuck this guy. He's no better <laughs> than a murderer. He's a baddie. Although sure one murder won't make up for another. If you let me. What would you do, Mike? I don't know. I guess you'll find out after. I fucking hate you. Yeah. 
Uh, one murder, one won't, make murder up. won't make up for another. These miners have no right to harm him. You'd see him spared after his innumerable misdeeds. After he spared not a single of those unfortunate <laughs> miners lost to rot. I, I was just going to choose whatever you did pick. <laughs> there you have it. And after Lord, should I kick you up into the next rabbit crowd we have on the phone? <laughs> I, I just wanted to fight you. We haven't done this in a while. Whatever time we do, you skip it. Yeah, I want to skip it again, anyways. Do I don't, I don't give a fuck about record versus justice. Is no less criminal than that of which Lawrence stands accused. <laughs> uh, justice fuck! Why does it keep my thing going up? Whatever, fun, fun. If you'd see a guilty man go free, my timid is higher. My reason is not bad, though. The two of you to face your face. Okay, fight me. Okay, fine. I'll do actual rock paper scissors. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> Get <laughs> fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Show that Bonodoro Braco what you think of him. <laughs> okay, bro. <laughs> I, think, I, think, I think you're bad, kid. I think you're bad, kid. Fucking <laughs> 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 better! Bonodoro Braco, what you think of him? No! <laughs> Get fucked, kiddo! You screwed up my flawless victory. No. couldn't be trusted. How is Get fucked, you know. Oh shit. <laughs> you came so close. All right, we'll do it your way. You're damn right we will. No, please, Source Hunter, you can't let them do this. Oh, what a fool I was to execute the guild's demands. It's the guild you ought to be after, not me. I'm merely the messenger. Please, please. Oh, hear that, Lawrence. That's the sound of the scales of justice tipping in our favor. I'd suggest you say your prayers, but I doubt you've a soul left to pray for. I just stabbed his ass. Oh, dude, he dropped loot. Trial, verdict, and execution. Matter of minutes. So I got vindictive. These immaculates have more on their minds than due process. Yeah, that, that gives me more fucking a chance to hit bonus on the back. I don't want that. Alright, what kind of sweet loot did we get from him? Nothing good. Alright, now we can loot his house, though. <laughs> I already did, though. Oh, okay. Oh, well, there's empty bottles and hunting bow. I can sell that. Also, what does Joan have? Sort by weight. He's got a shit ton of cloth scraps. I'm gonna send, I'm gonna send some of this to Homestead. That's what's weighing you down? The Apparent, cloth scraps? Apparently. Actually, I didn't loot the barrels in here. Let's, let's do that. You're a bad man. Alright, we have. Would one you give to me, Stebrium? <laughs> no, of course not. That doesn't even harm us anymore. Yeah, but it is fucking. It's the, the most all you've recently. It's the bit. heaviest thing you've recently obtained. Okay. Black Gate. Did we not go to Black Gate? Where's the way portals that we have? Oh, Black Gate is, right? Yeah. Why the fuck is it all the way there? Like, why is there no fucking portals there? Apparently we've unlocked like nothing here. Well, okay, let's just go to Goblin Village. Once you do that, I'm going to sell. I'll catch up. All right. Yeah, I'll, I'll just fast forward to be going there, guys. All right, hit that bloodstone because if you look at its resistances, uh, with Lore Master, it is resistant to everything except for Tenebrium. So you should be able to kill it. You have a Tenebrium weapon. I do. Somewhere, let me just find it. Oh, there it is. Go, Medora. I still see her those fucking swords in front of her. It's really annoying. I, I don't know why she has that. Fucking Medora with the one two Debrium weapon. We probably should have more of that, but yeah. Alright, you did it. 
At least and put a real weapon back on. The demon's all dead. Ziggs is talking to me. Oh, is he? Have you given those... Am I? You've given those demons the old 1-2 right in the void rift. No, not a moment too soon. Our shelter point is saved, dear hunter. Quite saved. We only have you to thank. Excellent practice for your wrenching of all existence from the void's grasp, don't you think? Yes, Source Hunter. I'm feeling quite optimistic myself. That's it. That's it. Where the fuck did Joanna have to say? God, we fucking did it! A void demon. A creature so powerful it can tear the fabric of time and uproot the depths of space. To overcome such a foe, one needs more than skill and cunning. I do not know what you are exactly, Hunter, but it is more than human. You are beyond. You are divinity somehow. Original sin. The time will come when all will be revealed, of that I am certain. When it does, I hope you will accept what fate has in store for you and the powers that are bound to come with it. Eh. Uh, uh, I just said, De if Destiny has more in store for me, I will readily accept it. You should both be keen on the change that will come, for you have no choice in the matter. That which lurks within you must manifest. One may put the soul of a tiger in the body of a turkey, and still it will try to hunt. So it is with you. Something greater than all of us lies hidden within the mortal frame of man that surrounds your being. You are but a shell, and I for one grow impatient, anticipating that which must hatch. Okay. Thank you, Joan. So the demons that are down there are dead now, by the way. Yeah, that's what I said to you. So, I don't know, let's see what happens when we touch the portal. Apparently nothing. Alright, well we are gonna do we're we are gonna do two things. First of all, I'm gonna use two of the bloodstones. Bloodstone. What? As powerful as it is sinister. There we go. It's, it gives us some experience with some other shit. And the, I'm gonna use the other Bloodstone. one. We get some experience from it, which is nice. I don't think the inert stones do anything. But I'm keeping one bloodstone still with me. Uh, and now we're going to go back to the end of time. Because now we have like a shit ton of stuff opened. Because not only were the star stones we found before, there was also the, the two I just used. Because we don't, we don't need that many. Your efforts have borne even more fruit. A new piece of the tapestry has been mended. The weaver's been hard at work with the thread Starstone has borne her, and a whole portion of history has been rewoven. Rejoice, my friends, rejoice! For now we witness a tale from the eons torn from time, but now, thanks to you, restored. After the war was won, the Void Dragon remained a great threat to all existence. And so, upon the Anvil of Creation, the God Box was crafted. The Void was locked within, but still the question remained, who would guard the Box? The two generals offered themselves. They would give up life and glory to stand Sentinel. Transformed into immortal beings, they would be the Void's eternal guardians. They placed the Box and the Guardians in the First Garden, home of Astarte and of the world's most beautiful power, Source. For time immemorial, the Guardians stood by the God Box, no longer human in body or in mind, but duty personified. Suddenly, story out of nowhere. So that is who we were. Demigod Guardians of the God Box. <laughs> Demigods? Immortals? 
I like what I'm hearing. You stand alone with that opinion. <laughs> Fuck you. Even gods can die. And from what we've seen here in this realm, little good came from being a half divine. I'm bald and you're cautious. Congratulations. Do I want to be cautious or are we bald? No. And... no. <laughs> we have like, I have nine bolds, so initiative is increased by one. Your in sneaking is increased by one, though. Nah, I'm still more bold than I am cautious. So I'm doing fine. I have also three points available. Did I level up recently? Yeah, I did. Holy shit. Yeah, we loved from the Star Stones. Uh. I figured you would have noticed. Yeah, fucking whatever. I want to get more into witchcraft, though. I want to get more master. I don't think I can do any more in the uh, willpower bodybuilding. No, I can't anyways. Alright, we, we unlocked probably a buttload of stuff, so let's just come over here. Actually, let's go talk to this thing first. I salute you, my master. Other elementals lie in wait until with a word you command them to action. Which one of them, pray, has your preference? Ice, earth, or air, Kent? Um, let's go ice. Why, why ice? Ice sucks. Let's do air, how about that? I don't even know why I asked you, I'm just gonna do whatever. Nah, you're an asshole. Yeah, yeah it is. Yes, it is. Fuck you. Fight <laughs> 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 me, motherfucker! Look, I haven't the time to squabble, but I have the time to strike you down. The choice was an unwise one, which you should be- Oh, this oh. Space bar. Fuck it, I'm lazy. Yeah, yeah. Motherfucker! <laughs> We'll do it. will be done. <laughs> that will be done. Yeah. Wait, okay, we don't have another one yet. Let's go into this one. Fucking bitch. <laughs> this place is positively brimming with the surge of storm and lightning. Yeah, nice job. You follow the fucking... the lightning area. Yeah, that's what I wanted, because I want to buy some fucking lightning skills. Look, see the fucking... Uh, Astolot is here, where the fuck that is. <laughs> Trying to kill him. Always am I the trickster. Always am I the malefactor. Yet all I do is speak the truth. They failed before, and they will fail again. The void. I can see it approaching in their eyes. What's that guy's problem? I like you to train me in air magic. <laughs> yes, snort that spaghetti. Oh, oh, pardon, pardon. Yes. So, you'd like to learn to cast with the best of them, would you? Have a look. Oh, dude, they got fucking scoundrel abilities here. You can learn wind up toy. Uh, wind up toy. That's nice, dear. And la lacerating. Lacerate, dude. You need. I need lacerate. Requires no. a dagger? Fuck that. Fuck fuck your bleeding, dude. No. <laughs> fuck needs, everything about your bleeding. Needs a dagger. Uh, let's see. Tornado skill book, thunder jump. I'm just seeing if there's anything I want. Nether swap is kind of nice. Make two characters switch places. Oh, I can look. Well, that, no, that's some master ability. Teleportation. Make invisible. Uh, chain lightning is also pretty good. The range on that 17 meters. All right. Oh, I took the leaf. All right. Well, let's go read what this is all about. Another ancient di diary. All right. Well, I'm gonna leave again. I'm gonna go see the other rooms you've unlocked. You know, I get another uh, swap does sound pretty good. Why don't you? Why don't you pick up that guy? I don't know who would learn it though. Oh, I only have one point in arrow third. Yeah, John would be probably the guy to do it. 
Or high, uh, high the other one. No, actually, it's gonna be a while before I do that. Probably shouldn't have unlocked this one. <laughs> so, you want another swap? Uh, eventually, but we don't have to do it now. Just, just Fine, I'll wait then. What the fuck is with all these imps here? <laughs> oh, wait, the dude, the imp back in the cave. We got the imp. Yeah. Give you courage. D I think we got too many here. Go get more. No. Mm -hmm. Dude, you need to get over here and look at this fucking shit. for the state your homestead is currently in. It's like a zoo in here. Or worse, an imparium. That's right. These red little blighters appeared as out of nowhere when another one of the portals became active. God seven or seven hundred. If there's one thing I can't stand, it's imps. Uh, there's a description in that statement I, f I feel bound to point out. I Tell me a bit more about this band of zigzags. Why I never? I'm not one of them. Not one of those exiles that were slaves to demons and their own inadequacies. Ah, but talk to them if you must hear their history. I haven't the stomach for the vagaries of my own species. No. What I need is the sound of a symphony, a whiff and a swig of old tasty wine, and above all, a shelter away from imps. Alright. What's the Hall of Darkness? I sense an eerie presence here. Demons. <laughs> Demons! You do not disappoint. I knew you'd come this way. Room by room you encroach upon this territory, willfully. Torn from time. No, you do not disappoint. Something much more harmful still. You excruciate beyond all thinkable bearing. You have our thankfulness, our eternal gratitude, the acknowledgement of the void. So why do you fight us? Why do you stand against the promise of oblivion? Relent, guardians. Relent. You did your duty long, long ago. Do not undo what had to be done. Was a dick. I wonder what he meant by that. There's a demon here. Oh, Johan. <laughs> You've changed quite considerably, I see. Yes, the divine is but a glimmer in the farthest reaches of your gaze. Well, perhaps I can help you. One of your kind ought to be a bit stronger of arm. A bit quicker of wit, after all. And we are all counting on you, so. What can you offer me? Yourself redone, of course. Your very parts and pieces reorganized into something simply better. Uh, okay, we can apparently get some... Okay, let's say I'd like to find some ability points. I'd quite like to help you, my friend. But unless you've got a mark of talent to spare, no deal can be struck. So, you can reset your all your points here. Nice. And I'd quite like to help you, my friend. Those marks of ability of yours look awfully appealing. Perhaps we can make a trade. One for one. One mark to improve a primary attribute for you. And a mark of ability for me. How does that sound? I uh, know, because I want to keep that. What a terrible, terrible shame. I do hope you come to your senses soon, Change my subject. Take, I take my leave. So I think I, I think I know about this. If you reset all your abilities, it means you lose all your skills and you have to get them again. Yeah, I heard about this as well. Yeah, I just I read about that somewhere. I knew it's this like, was coming oh, you at fuck some up, point. You can just res you can just respect, but it's pretty expensive. Yeah. 
Oh, it's 1,000 gold, which is nothing to us, I think. Yeah, but it's the, more the cost of getting all the skill books back. Okay. Yeah, so I'm, I'm not... I, I'm like my stuff how it is. Alright, Zigzag is probably now going to the next place. I think I think he wants to unlock the next fucking thing. I guess you want to get ice? I'll get ice for you. I really need you both to be here. Much depends on the knowledge I will share. Uh, what? Ah, wonderful. You're both here once more. Can you guess what's happened? Surely by now you know the signs. Or perhaps you can simply guess from how utterly giddy I am. Take a look. All your work has not been for naught. This last star stone you discovered has given the weaver just what she needed to mend another portion of the tapestry. Another tantalizing tidbit of long lost history awaits us. Another piece of your story is ours to discover. Oh, how very thrilling. For millennia, the god box was flanked by the two devoted guardians. But Astarte's playmate, a creature called the Trife, turned her attention to the forbidden box. I may know a way to destroy what's inside, hissed the scheming creature. Together, we can set the Guardians free. Open its lid, Astarte, and we can have a look together. Astarte trusted her friend and assented. She pitied the Guardians and welcomed a chance to free them. Let me help you, she whispered into the ear of one. I know your duty, but you both deserve a chance at freedom. Haven't you suffered enough of this chore? She asked the other. Look, your companion is free already. The guardians, unaccustomed to such attention, started. She had planted a seed of curiosity within them, rekindled a desire that had, for eons, lain dormant. Slowly, they glanced at one another, and the trife's trap was sprung. I knew that motherfucker was up to no good. Master. Other elementals lie in wait until you with a word you command them to action. Which one of them pray as your preference? So you actually want ice? Yes. And that is your final choice. You know what? No, I've changed my mind. <laughs> Fight me. What do you just pick? Ice. But I want ice. Yeah, it's a good, but I have it. Me too. Let's make another pick. <laughs> oh, why don't you want to play this game with me? You're no fun. Perhaps you would like to reconsider, and, and that is your final choice. Yes, it is. What are you picking? I don't know what you're picking. Ice. Hello, ice. It isn't. I want to go with another elemental. What's wrong with you? Look, I haven't the time to squabble, but I have the time to- The choice was an unwise one, which you well, should skipping. be able to recognize. Yes! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let us choose well. another one. Have it your way. Fine, you know what? I'm gonna pick- I'm gonna pick Earth now. That is yes, it is. Now you don't get ice. In fact, it isn't. <laughs> I want to go with another <laughs> elemental. You always want your- Why does it like- Can't you be considerate? I'm sorry. Change? Why is it when I win the argument you get to pick again? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. The choice was an never win. one, which you should be able to recognize. <laughs> Yay, Earth! No, no, we'll do as I say. <laughs> Thy will be done. Is this your fault? We were seduced then, tricked into neglecting our duty for the briefest of moments. Tricked, seduced, excuses for failure. It was our duty to guard the box, and we faltered. Indeed. But perhaps it isn't too late to set right what we've wronged. Obedient. Is this ice? No, that's, that's nature. Oh yeah, that's right, I didn't do ice. That's right, I didn't even open that one. Rocks and forests. 
This is a plane worth hey. <laughs> this is your fucking fault. I did it. Dearest guardians, how I rejoice at the sight of your growth, both in power and in prowess. And yet I cannot help but wonder, will it ever be enough? Will you craft yourselves once more into the warriors that you were? Oh, in the end, you are like infants still. Infants that would perish with a broken whale had they not their mother's milk to suckle. But you always were like children, weren't you? As are we all in the eyes of the gods. And yet they set an impossible task before you, then blamed you when you failed. How foolish even the divines can be. How lacking in compassion. Do you feel like a child? Being kept in the dark about so many things. I guess we'll have to find more Starstone and grow up. The spirit of Father Nature came to me in a dream last night, and he told me to welcome you. Yeah, I'd like to train you, you to train me in Earth magic. With utmost pleasure, my friend. All right, what does he got? Your knowledge Ooh. is meant to be shared. Death punch. <laughs> dude, you that's right. I gave you a scroll of that. Oh, I need death punch, dude. That's a yeah, you do. Silence the target. That seems pretty good. Invulnerability. Yeah, it can only be used once per combat. Resurrect an ally to 50% of vitality. I can actually get that as an, as an ability. What kind of a... Uh, summon poison slug. Holy shit. You seem amazing. Earthquake. Dude, I, I need to get more of this shit. Good thing we didn't get ice. Assume you God damn it, yeah, Han! So <laughs> I assume you addressed me. Fuck it. I assume you addressed me. When do we ever right. want to talk to him? That's the question. <laughs> right, so you want Earthquake? Uh, no, because I can't know the fucking points for any of that. So you don't want any of this? I, I, there's no way I can. What's the, what's the other school it had? It had like, uh... Witchcraft, witchcraft. and Neuromancy. Eventually, punch. eventually witchcraft, but not now. Oh, Th these fuckers keep following me around. I'd say hello, but I'd much rather say heaven. Oh, get it, get it. Yeah, you get it. Tell me about yourself. It sounds like a chav. Listen to this one. What are you calling him that hasn't got any eyes? Anna? Ah. Uh. And here's one for you. What do you call a selfless imp? Anna? The fuck? Hey. That leaf doesn't belong to you, eh? See my magic oh, box. It's got oh, oh, Dude, this guy has a huge healing potion. Dude, it's it heals 75%. I don't know how to make that. <laughs> Found any interest in treasure source, Hunter? Anything you'd like to share? Yeah, buy that guy's fucking potion. Oh, I had the most beautiful dream source, Hunter. You only just want it because it's. Alright, I don't care. Uh, it's so, bullshit. Uh, yeah, naturally. Where's Zigzags? How can I tell? It's dead. Oh, okay. Is there anything else we want to explore here? I think there is. Where's Master Zigzags? They all look the same to me. Master I give a super healing potion to you, Mike. Oh yeah, of course he did. Oh dude, there is another place you can go to. Dude, there's so much to fucking explore here because we haven't done this in forever. And the best part is, I think I know where we can get another bloodstone. <laughs> oh yeah, remember like the, the Iron Maiden? Yeah. A moment of your time, if it pleases you. I have been pondering and brooding, deliberating and deducting, and I have come to the conclusion that I may well know who our true enemy is. Now, our foe is the Void, of course, the usurper of time and space, but more dangerous even than the great and all-consuming nothing are those who are bent on helping it here. Or bent on helping it on Rivalon. I think he still lives. The one that set it all in motion. The one you've met here in the House of the Guardians. Talk about the demon that looks in the hall. these halls, aren't you? Yes. Him. It. 
The one who does not look quite like he used to. The one that whispered deceit and desire into Astarte's ears. He is friend to the Void, and he seeks to give it dominion once and for all. That is who I think he is. So the only thing he does is talk, and words aren't very dangerous. As a writer, I'm going to have to disagree with you there, but even then, please don't be fooled, for he does much more than wag his tongue. What we see here, in what was once your house, is most certainly real. But the demon, Astarte, they are, so I believe, mere manifestations of their true selves. Oh, he dwells somewhere. He must. It is a creature of blood and bloodlust, of lies and stratagems. All this time he has been plotting of that, I assure you. If our enemy has a heart, he is the one that makes it beat. That is my theory. All right. As much as it wants, we won't fall for its tricks. We shouldn't get overconfident. There is more to miss the eye. What is this? How good of you to drop by. That's this guy. She told me you had grown, you know. That simpleton of a girl. She felt the need to inform me of the fact, with that pathetic tinge of pride in her voice. As if I did not know. As if I haven't been watching you. Like a vulture, a dying beast. I could have plucked out those dewy eyes of hers and thrown them into a frying pan like eggs. Have you ever seen Sunny Side Up staring back at you? I have. But enough of this small talk. Yes, I have been watching you, and my amusement has turned into aggravation. Yet still, I yearn, yearn for the moment you finally become powerful enough to realize the true depths of your failure. When you do, I'll be there, drawing circles in the skies, watching, waiting, ready to pounce. We must be getting on his nerves. Excellent. I'll never look at a fried egg in the same way ever again, though. The end of creation. Wow. But you create something. <laughs> Joanne, maximize your crafting ability. Oh, what the fuck's up here? Oh, dude, this is like this is like the ultimate blacksmith thing right here. Holy fucking shit! All this stuff here. Arrowheads. My friend and ally. Okay. Well, let's see what the logs say for that. General's tarot. General, I'm gonna say he wanted absolute power. All right. Uh, all right. Let's see if Zigzag has more for us. So here we have the Elemental Forge or something. It's our own version of it. There, it's called it's the, the Forge of Creation. Well, yeah, this is where we now can craft things that are, I guess, much better for us now. Mike, there's a fucking door here. Is there? Where's the door? Come back to me. Oh yeah, so there is. A mythic chest. They're locked. A legendary chest. Is that that quest with the chest from before? Fable chest. No, I think I think remember we saw one of these in Brachus Rex's chamber? Oh, I guess so. It was like this kind of a magical lock. Oh. I think. We need to get some magical unlock spells. Oh, that's right, yeah. We 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 didn't unlock his either, actually. We just left it mm -hmm. there. Alright, well, if you figure it out, let me know. I think I got another place we can go to. Holy shit. I really need you both to be here. Get over here! Much depends. Get the fuck over here. There you both are. How jolly. I always do prefer an audience when I give one of my history lessons. My friends, I see you found another star stone. <laughs> another star stone. 
But I haven't been exactly idle either, for I think I may have nearly figured out why Sauce became so terribly tainted. If Astarte is the goddess of the Sauce, and the void was contained in her very garden, might it stand to reason that it was in fact the void who turned Sauce into such a dark and terrible power? But the tapestry has been rewoven. Time has been restored. I must speculate no more, and instead we must see what new shred of our tale you've uncovered. With the Guardians distracted, Astarte lifted the lid of the God Box. What she saw was nothingness. Astarte had called forth the Void Dragon, whose sole purpose was to undo all creation. Caught off guard and terrified, the Guardian's sworn protectors fled. But Astarte stood firm. She grabbed hold of the dragon and hurled it and herself into the reaches of the Void. Here she battled the dragon for all eternity. For his deception, the trife was cast out of the first creation. He fell to Rivalon, a monstrous creature unworthy of the realm of the gods. Since that terrible day, Source has been tainted by the presence of the Void. A once beautiful power has become corrupted, and those attempting to wield it often go mad in the process. Well done. All right. Uh, well, first of all, I'll talk to you. You may have been tricked into allowing Astarte to open the God Box, but we fled when faced with the Void once more. We, what cards you were? Let us pray. We only have time to undo our mistakes. Just pick the one where you don't have to. You don't have to read that much. How could we have known what was to come? <laughs> we were simple sentinels by then. And ones with faith in a starty to boot. How could we have known what was oh, wait, to come? Fuck! Use his voice. We were simple sentinels by then. And ones with faith in a starty to boot. I'm vindictive. Alright, you know what, guys? We're gonna just cut it off here. Just because I thought we were gonna be done this, like, ra rather soon. But apparently that was not the case. This is taking a very long time. Fuck, I need, I need forgiving shit. <laughs> God damn it. Whatever, I'm not immune to curse anymore. But yeah, we're gonna cut off here, uh, but we're gonna continue going through this, so take care of him, bye.